Hi everyone, it's Steve from SmartPE. Thanks for joining me again today. And we're going to be looking at the protocol associated with the Illinois Agility Test. And obviously, well it sounds obvious, but this test measures agility. Please, please, please make sure you take note of that. As obvious as it sounds, people tend to make mistakes when asked which test tests agility. It is the Illinois Agility Test. To set this test up, it is 10 metres in length and then 5 metres in width, and you run a total of 60 metres. But because it's testing agility, it's requiring you to change direction quickly by weaving in and out of cones. So what you're going to do is you're going to start at the start, laying down on your front, and on the signal you're going to sprint and weave in and out of the cones as fast as you possibly can. And the time taken is your final score. Now, if you are planning on conducting and completing this test yourself, please make sure you look at the direction that you've got to run in because it has to be completed in that way for the results to be accurate. Once you've got your final score or your final time, you can then compare your time to the normative data table. This will then give you your rating for agility. It doesn't give you a rating for anything else, not for speed or power, but it gives you a rating for agility. That's really important that you remember that. So what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to read the question at the bottom of the page and I'd like you to compare Jerome's 18.6 seconds that he scored in his Illinois agility test to the normative data in order to work out his rating for his agility. So before you pause the video, make sure that you highlight any particular information that you think is important within the question or within the table. So pause your video now and then when you're ready, press play to check your answer. Okay, so as Jerome scored 18.6 seconds, when compared to the normative data, his rating that you should have given was below average, as it's between 18.2 and 19.3 seconds. So, if you'd like any more help with any other fitness tests, just scan the QR codes in your pack.